What up everyone, it's the one and only Evil Collector back at you with another action figure review. Today's review is with the Marvel Legends Fantastic Four Retro Wave Fire Lord. And I was able to pick this Vato up at my local comic shop, so I was happy to get him, man. Wasn't gonna go today, I was gonna chill with the wifey, but you know what? I said, I'm gonna take a cruise down to the shop and pop, pop, here he is, Fire Lord. So in the back of him, you just get an image of him with how to put his hands on because some boys don't know how to do it, but about 99.9 .9 dude. <laughs> so on the sides, you don't really get nothing. You just you know the shell of it to see to see him. You know, you can check him out, all his custom paints, to make sure all his paint apps are on there correct before you purchase him. Let's see his bio. You want to read it? Pause it. UPC guys, can't forget about it. In case y'all looking for it, pause it right there. Bam, man. All right, guys, so let's uh get Fire Lord out the box and see what he's all about. So here's Fire Lord out the box. And looking really cool, y'all. Like, I really dig this figure. I don't know if we've ever had him before in another series back in the days or recently, but this one is very good. Real quick, um, I just want to show you the, the hair on him. It looks transparent and cool. Look at that. How it separates the glossy uh, red into the orange. Or if it looks yellow, I mean, to me it looks orange, but it could be yellow. Cool, man. His face scope is cool, too. Paint naps are good. Real good. Flames on both of my legs. So, yeah, man. Butterfly joints on this vato. Cool, cool, man. Real quick, let's get to it. Before we start getting to his... Uh, all his uh, movements. Let's get to his uh, toothpick that he goes with. Not a toothpick, I'm sorry, Q-tip. <laughs> so the Q-tip, his, uh, his weapon of choice has also the translucent and the orange. Excuse me. The, not in the red much, but mainly in the orange. It looks cool in the light. So it's a cool, cool weapon, man. I can dig it. Or build it. And then, of course, another set of hands he has with him. Grip your hands for, to hold that weapon. And that's all pretty much he comes with, man, which is cool. You know, I've only a lot of crazy stuff. We just needed the character himself for Hasbro to put him for us. And here he is, guys. So, yeah, like I said, man, um, cool looking figure. Let's get to his artic articulation real quick. He looks up a very good amount because of that um, peg movement. He looks down very good. 360 on the head and on the Shoulder, upper torso movement. I'm sorry, upper torso movement. <laughs> upper bicep movement. Double jointed elbows. Mine's a little stiff. Wrist swivel with the hinge. Upper torso movement now. So he can move that much down. Look back that much. My, my waist movement is super tight. I'm not going to miss with it and maybe break it off. Splits about this much. Upper thigh movement, very good. Double jointed knees. Upper boot cut movement, good. And then ankle rocker with the pivot. So this, this dude is legit. I like it. I dig this fire lord. Let's go ahead and put on his weapon as well. Put his hands, put on some weapons on him, or his weapon. They go on, they go on fairly easy. Very baby, a baby gummy, you know, not too much, but a little, a little bit. <laughs> A 
little tough to stand up. A little bit of gummy, guys. Well, mine is a little bit. And there's your fire, Lord. Not bad. Uh, let's do uh, size comparisons. I got my Silver Surfer Walgreens exclusive. We'll put it right there. You know what? I'll put it right here. Not bad. And you know what? I'll just throw in the, the Fantastic Four, right? Why not? There you go. Put my, these are all the Walgreens exclusive ones I have. So you get an idea. And yes, I'm also expecting to get my Galactus too soon. Um, he's supposed to be being shipped out here late November. So keep an eye for yours if you got one. Uh, hopefully y'all did, man. Of course, you have to have that. That's a centerpiece for me and my collection and collecting Marvel Legends. Um, hope you like my video. Uh, subscribe to my channel. Hit the notification bell for more content. Uh, drop me a comment below. Let me know what y'all think about this figure. If you like them, if you don't. For me, I do. Out of 1 through 10, I'll give them about 7.5. You know what? It could have been better. It's a little gummy. Uh, articulation is great. The paint naps are great. Translucent, the hair, the translucent fire all over him is badass. But uh, 7.5, just because of the, it's kind of a little gummy, like I said, man. But other than that, like I said, 7.5. <laughs> Anyways, guys, y'all take care. Uh, peace out and evil out. Like and subscribe to the Evil Collector channel and hit the notification bell for more content.